Hello again. Continuing the theme of Tyneside composers, I'd like to play for you a piece by William Shield. Shield was born in Swalwell, Gateshead. He was taught music by his father, but he and his mother died while Shield was still a child, and the orphan was apprenticed to a shipbuilder. However, he was able to continue studying music and learned the violin and composition with Charles Averson whose work I played last week. He gained a reputation as a concert performer and decided to travel to London, becoming violinist and violist at the Orchestra of the King's Theatre in the Haymarket, London. The operatic repertoire he played there may have spurred him on to write his own stage music. His first work, The Flitch of Bacon, was a hit. He also began composing violin duets around the same time, one of which was the very first piece I played on this channel. He was appointed as composer for Covent Garden, which is now the Royal Opera House. There he met Joseph Haydn. Shield said that he learned more about music in the company of Haydn than anyone else. Rossina was Shield's most popular work. Written as a comic opera for Covent Garden, it was intended to be a light piece to follow a more serious opera. This work pioneered the use of English, rather than Italian, spoken dialogue, and a lighter comical theme. As such, it can rightfully be considered as the first example of our current day musicals. I will play for you the Overture to Rossina. Originally written for a small orchestra, I have arranged this for four violins. This piece showcases some of the key moments throughout the play and has four different components. It starts with a joyful, melodic theme, then moves into a slow and emotional passage. Next comes a sprightly jig, and the piece ends with a piece very reminiscent of a familiar Scottish folk tune. See if you can spot it. I hope you enjoy my arrangement and rendition of Shield's Overture to Rossina for four violins.
Thank you.